Why are you actively helping us decipher the book when we're using it to thwart the Abbey's plans? Um... Do you think I might be deliberately misleading you? Laying a trap of some sort for you all? Are you? I think you're a lot of things, demon. But foolish is not one of them. <laughs> that means she thinks higher than of you I than I do. What Lord Artorius yes. is trying to accomplish. And there's something happening in the world I'm right now. I'm glad of you for owning that. I want that. to know what it is. Unfortunately, little old Eleanor has never been deemed trustworthy enough to be given such information. Ooh. So, my only option is to find out True. for myself. True. True. You've got the soul searching down at least. The Abbey and your band of rogues follow two different paths. But something tells me either will lead me to the same destination. Yeah, that's true. And so you don't see any need to lie to us? Exactly. And what'll you do if those truths don't line up cleanly with what you believe? She'll have I'm to fucking deal not with sure it. Yet. Of course. As honest an answer as any. Either way, it looks like you'll be working with us for the near future. Yes, for now. For now. Hey, could I ask you something? What is it? About the Therians. Mm -hmm. I've heard you call yourself a Therian before. Yeah. Is there any particular insight you have about them? No, none. Artorius said I was one, that's all. Oh, that Artorius said that? I Does didn't even know. You? Nope, not at all. If you're not worried, then neither am I. Yeah, we're gonna have to cut your head off, I'm that's surrounded all. surrounded by freaks. <laughs> what? You're a freak! But, was that truly the reason Ceres chose me? Could be. I don't fucking know. I didn't even know that they announced that. And that's the thing. I think Eleanor has been justifying why she's doing it. But I do believe she's just really curious and she just wants to know the answer. I mean, nobody told her the answers. They, they kept her in the dark. She seems to be intelligent and she seems to have a mind that can, like... She's not stupid. She's figuring shit out. They got more shit to talk about. Always got shit to talk about. Velvet keeps picking on Madame Eleanor. Well, total opposites, Velvet so I know picks on everyone. Sometimes, but Velvet takes it too far. You really think they're totally opposite? They're very if different. Madame Eleanor is a white lily, then Velvet is a black rose. <laughs> if Edgy Madame as Eleanor fuck. Is a soaring Pegasus, then Velvet is a wolf in the shadows. If Madame Eleanor is a plate of spaghetti carbonara. Velvet is squidding noodles with Gross. I don't follow Both you Both of those sound delicious. I think I get the point. Delicious. <laughs> Disgusting. I'm sure you understand. The two have nothing at all in common. And since they don't share anything in common, some fighting now and then just can't be helped. Yeah, well, it hasn't been anything they that... They beautiful hair. Damn, what was okay. that trying to get I'm with them? a noble exorcist and an aloof demon. Eleanor sometimes treats you coldly. And Velvet has helped me more times than I can count. Madam Eleanor gives herself fully to the salvation of others. But Velvet is bent solely on revenge. You know what? That's true. That means they're both motivated by thoughts of others. Um, what? Madam <laughs> Eleanor at all the same as the brooding You just said, Velvet. you just said that. Both of them talk to me when it's just the two of us together. Of course, but you're say you're biased. Contrary. I'm only telling you what I've experienced. <laughs> Actually, I feel that Madame Eleanor isn't really reaching out to yeah, me. Yeah, because you're fucking it's annoying. Right I will drown you in that you. lake. I'm here for you, Bienfu. You oh, Lafayette, you're that so just sweet. Makes me feel lonelier. <laughs> Fuck off. You two are opposites yourselves. True. Huh? How the fuck do I get over the- oh. Wow, I'm a fucking idiot. Whoa! Out of my face! Whoa! Everybody! No! Leave me alone! Do, 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 do. Ooh. Or something here. This rocky shore just keeps going. Just don't step on any sea slugs, okay? Why not? What's the big deal? It's yeah. just that it isn't pretty. Their insides squeak Oh, everywhere. God, what? gross. That sounds pretty traumatizing. Yeah, it does. Then again, if you pickle their innards, it makes for a great snack. You eat them? <laughs> oh, don't be a baby. You've had worse. 
Forget the sea slugs. I Try mean, not to step on the you, coral. you've Good eaten point. something. Coral is alive and needs our protection. It needs and our protection. It needs our protection. Coral is alive. Of those reasons. <laughs> it needs Although Manon appears similar to Maclear Beach, it was formed by a completely different <laughs> process. Now that you mention it, this what? area is covered by rocks. Maclear is just your average seashore. But Manon here was made by the slow corrosion of seaside caves. They were worn away by the waves? But Eleanor will eat those but fucking mainly, penguins. It was the handiwork of a rock eating species of coral known as ravening table. But coral. I guess the slugs Stay are like bugs, so they're just disgusting. I wouldn't eat right bugs. <laughs> ah, so that's why it tingles every time I touch the coral. Why didn't you warn us? Jesus earlier? Christ! Yeah. He always does that. He always doesn't warn us till too late. We'll need to be extremely wary. <laughs> Crash throw. Even a short weapon is effective up close. <laughs> training can help it get even closer. <laughs> Mine gets as long as I want it to be. Damn, Mikey Lou, yeah. <laughs> Lappy said. Have you been taking care of that rhino stat roast like a good boy? I mean, he pulled of it out course. of his ass recently, I sure so I feel like before I go to sleep, feeds it your ass. Uh. How long are you going to keep on calling it a rhino stat roast? I don't know. It's a new kind of beetle, so it's going to be hard to tell if it's really a rhino or a stag. Aww. You're asking a lot of questions. Bienfu, do you like bugs? Duh! I love rhinoceros and stag beetles both. What guy doesn't find them fascinating? I will never understand right? this. I don't so understand kind of do guys that like bugs. Rhino or stag? I know, I know. It's interest. Oh, Everybody likes question. what they like. Y'all like but whatever the what? fuck you like, Miss but I hate bugs. Surefire way to tell. I didn't know there was a way to tell. Yeah, but if I do it, you gotta name it after me, all right? This little bitch. Uh, come on. What guy doesn't wish he had a cool bug named after himself, right? What are you gonna name it? Bug Enfu? Miss Mogilu told me that this technique is so good that it's only fair to have a bug named after you in return. Yeah, shut the fuck so up and go away. Say, man to man. Come on, let's live the dream. Let's live the oh, dream, right. Lord. How can I say no to that? Besides, we all did work together to capture it anyway. Um, Yay! actually, Bamfu didn't do shit to capture it. Right. Show me the bug, and I'll tell you what it He's is. He's not even technically in Ms. our party. Mugley says you need to open up its outer wings and get a good whiff of the thin underwings. What? Uh, That's I'm pretty sure disgusting. I remember rhinoceros and stag beetles smelling really nasty under their wings. Is it really that bad? Why not find out for yourself? Um, yeah, no, no. I think I'll pass. I don't really want to go around Maybe sniffing you fucking do this beetles. After all, Bien Phil. You probably just want to hog the name all to yourself. Well, too bad. A real man never goes back. Bien Phil, Maggie Lou is tricking you, you much, and Lafayette's trying, trying to help and if you. It smells really zesty. Then it's a stag beetle. I don't know about this. Just let him do it, Laffy said. <laughs> Just volunteered. let him do it. I can do Just it. let him do Just it. You watch. <laughs> That's fucking <laughs> disgusting. Be <laughs> here. This smell is the most bad, bad thing that ever bad, bad in it. I hate you, BM Food. Go fucking hang he yourself. With his eyes still open. Hey, wake up. Wake up, BM Food. Miss Mogilu. <laughs> as soon as I smelled it, their faces. I agree with them. Literally exploded. Lord, he looks like he's having a bad dream. <laughs> I spy with my little eyes a kiddo who's spying at my bewitching waist. I'm really glad that Maggie Lou actually oh, treats Lafayette like a fucking just couldn't help child. It. What are those books anyway? Oh, she doesn't try and question. ride his face Since like a fucking pedal. I'll the secrets of my tomes just for you. Ah, right, can't really the trust the Magalu though. And my magic encyclopedia in the front. That one I mostly use for oil blotting paper. <laughs> What's oil blotting paper? It's a girl thing. 
The two on the left are my heavy book, a girl which I thing. use for flower pressings. What? And then my super pop-up book. A super pop-up book? When you open it, it pops out with the force of a raging river! <laughs> when an enemy has me cornered, I can just open it up facing a nearby wall and pop! Instant getaway! Instant getaway! Of course you would have a power like again. that. So I haven't used it in years. I can just what run away! right in front? That's actually layer cake. <laughs> Why? <laughs> really? Cake. Seared into its batter are precious bits of knowledge. Eating it is just what? as good for your brain as it is for your stomach. Wow. The fuck? I had no idea that was possible. She is so He's fucking dramatic. So I almost <laughs> feel bad. Aww, oh, your books poor... are so interesting, Maggie Lou. That's Maggie... really cool. Maggie Lou is no like, to your curiosity, I kind of there. feel bad about lying say? to this Wanna kid. Take a closer look? Boy, would I. If you really do, then say, Maggie Lou, I want to get to know you better. Maggie Lou? I want Please to get to don't know be you hitting on him too. All right, I accept. I'll accept. reveal to you my most private secrets. All right. What? Wow! So that's what's on the other side of these books. I wouldn't have ever guessed that. What? What the? What are you doing with Lofty Set? What? He said the he fuck? wanted to see, so I'm showing him. You have no right to stand in the way of his desires. Did she show him her pussy? It's my job to protect him as his vessel. Especially from someone so wicked as yourself. Also, what, what you're doing is contrary to public decency. Yeah, what contrary to, to public decent. decency. These bindings with the locks on them. This style used to be really popular. I don't understand. The is she hitting on Lava? I just complimented that you I for not you're doing such a that. Bad influence for him. I'll be keeping a closer eye on you. Yeah. You can't learn to take it easy. Keep Nobody's an eye on her. I want to marry you, you know. Whoa! Whoa! Burn! Whoa! Cat fight! Can you turn them over one more time? I want to see how the books attach to your belt. God, yeah, sure. she was showing him. <sighs> she lifted up the thing in front of her pussy. I, I didn't understand until I understood. What the fuck is wrong with this game? Why does everybody want a five-year-old boy? All right, talk again. Jesus, you guys. Whoa, that's galore. You guys talk so much. Hey, Moggy Lou. I was wondering about that book you have on your waist. The one you called your heavy book for flower pressings. For flower curiosity pressings? curiosity truly knows no bounds, does it, kiddo? Okay. Nobody else knows this, but since you're so interested, she is such I a liar. Jesus, she just loves playing with people's heads. My heavy book, the one I use for flower pressings, is none other than a collection of Bienfu's poetry. What? Bienfu likes to write poems. I bet those are yep. smutty as fuck. You'd never guess it, but he's actually just about the best Moloch poet around. Some people even call him the Great Norman Poet. I would Here, never I'll have guessed one. that. If there is something unimportant happening to the east, I'm made to go there and back. If there is something unimportant happening to the west, I'm made to go there this, and this back. This doesn't sound that good I yet. I never rest nor be at peace. Every day my life is a little <laughs> Damn! That's... That's heavy. heavy that got heavy. Isn't it? That's it's depressing. for pressing flowers. It's so wonderfully, oppressively heavy. <laughs> so wonderful. Lou, your face has gone all sinister It always looking. does. She looks evil. She looks evil as fuck. Y'all, leave me alone. The fuck up off my dick. Do, 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 How about it, Laffy said? Picking up on anything? Yeah, in the direction of the temple. The feeling's getting stronger now. Good. What's this? Uh, this is the temple. What do you mean, what's this? Oh, you mean... You mean the dying exorcists? Yeah. You know, I didn't really think there was a demon here. A demon. The demon we heard about? Sounds like it's having fun. Then yeah, we'll use this too much fun. Wait, use this distraction? This is terrible. And that's the thing, you gotta realize, like, all these exorcists that are dying and stuff, they're still humans. These are just like Eleanor's. Like, yeah, maybe they're brainwashed, maybe they're doing wrong, but they're probably just being deceived. They probably don't know what they're doing is wrong. Except for the big bads. Tell me. Wow, look outside. 
It's the ocean. I don't see the ocean. This was a place of worship for Amenoch, the water Empyrean. Makes sense. The ancients built this sanctuary underwater for the same reason that Eumacia's temples were built underground. But ah. building this underwater couldn't have been easy. No. Aye. Definitely couldn't With the have Earth been. Temples, all they had to do was keep digging. Here, they had water to contend with. How did yeah. they do it? You can't split the sea like you can a log. They hmm. started by stacking giant stone blocks in the shallows, creating an enclosed space. I think so smart. Then they drained the water and he's, expanded he's the enclosure. He's a know-it-all, but it's Once like a hot know-it-all. Like he's just like enough smart. Dry space, they were able to dig into the sea floor. It's mind-boggling, isn't it? Yeah, the humans it is. believe that by going through such great hardships to build these temples, they could show the depth of their devotion. Additionally, current research That's suggests like the site of this temple once sat on the sea coast. A lot of religions do. What? Are you saying I'm wrong? No, Ooh. I'm only reporting what I've read in academic journals. How would coastal ruins sink into the ocean? He did that thing though. The, the way he reacted slumber, to that. The land shifted. And this temple was swallowed by the sea. Ooh. Scholars were able to prove that the sand and the heavy I stones which formed an true. airtight seal around the structure. Later, people carved an undersea tunnel to connect to the temple, bringing it to its current state. Hmm. Now that you mention it, I think I read that book too. Revised theories on ancient architecture, right? That's the one. Aww, read, these Isaac? dorks. No, I only read the first edition. Oh, oh damn, he's so salty. I, expand the enclosure, I, I gotta the say that. The stones have to be carried out. Once that was pointed out as being too inefficient, alternate theories were developed. Hmm. The revised edition has a number of competing theories. <laughs> I highly recommend She's reading it. She's such a nerd. Uh, I will then. Salty. So, wait, was that a complete rebuttal of Eisen's explanation? <laughs> that, that was not my intention. Ah, it's okay. Archaeology is a continuous process of asking new questions and making new discoveries. Prevailing theories change all the time. What's yeah, the they anyway? do. It's science. Let's just get going. I think that's kind of a big turnoff for me right now. I know that they're like aiming it as Eleanor being the bad guy, but she's just telling the truth. I really don't like know-it-alls like that. Like, I say he's a hot know-it-all, and he is hot, and it's good that he's very smart, but it seems like he gets very upset when he's wrong. And that's the that's the bad side of a know-it-all. I've dated a guy like that, that that just, like, tried to prove me wrong all the time and got so upset whenever he was wrong. There's no Empyrean here, right, Aizen? If you're worried about it, why not flip that coin of his? Heads, no Empyrean. <laughs> tails, Empyrean. <laughs> it's Central. gonna land tails. But it always comes up tails. <laughs> yes. Like I said before, these temples are nothing more than places of worship built by human hands. The current religion started when humans, fearful of natural forces, well, the only way to be intelligent to is to accept changes and to accept. If you're concerned about that you're whether wrong or not one is sleeping in these ruins, why you're wrong. Just remember that their very existence is only legend. Pride can be a Evil very. Enominot certainly exists. Aye, but I've never heard a single story of anyone actually seeing an Empyrean. Enominot hmm. must be a special case then. Must be. That's true. I suppose so. If there but were four more you like think him, people would have seen these us, Empyreans at least say you they can't had. Disagree. People say they've seen God and shit. What's that? Is that a baddie? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yes, it is a baddie. Six and a half hours later. Wait. Oh, I can open these doors? Wow, I'm a fucking idiot. So I turn that... Okay. Now it all makes sense. I bet there's a chalice on the other side too, maybe? Ooh, I can go in there now. Yeah, in here, there's another one. Turn that, evaporate that shit up. A jewel is embedded in the monolith. You remove it, yes. You set the jewel. Evaporate, yes, let me through. What is that? Well, it wiped out the security for us, but. Looks like a werewolf. A code ra Oh my god, it's after Exorcist. Oh, look at that. Wolfie's got the crest of Amenoch. 
The same pendant worn by priestesses. Huh, interesting. And he really hates then exorcists because he saw me. Eleanor and he was like, fuck yeah. you. She must be the missing mother, Mahina. So she's evil. It can't be. She wanted to save the mother so bad for... <laughs> Damn it. Poor. <laughs> this situation Don't sucks. It. It's gonna eat you. She wanted to save the mom so bad for that poor kid. <laughs> Leave Mag and Lou alone! Man, this is devastating. Sorry we had to kill you. She's gonna turn back into the mom too right before she dies. To think a priestess, beloved by her village, would become a demon. Eleanor? She's never going to be the same again. This is the least I can do for her. Oh no, don't kill this her. Is recent. She's gonna kill someone finally. Huh? That feeling. <laughs> is she gonna turn back? Damn. Lafacette, she was gonna kill that demon for us and finally rid the world the demon be become evil. It. You guys like Velvet's new look? <laughs>